Oh, hello. How are you doing? Mm. I knew that. I love my job, but not when it sucks me dry and make me forget it. I will. Come over here. Take a look at this. Hey, what's with the oversized uh, boy toy? <laughs> I bought it for the new house. Well, we haven't started house hunting yet. No hunting necessary. Well, you have to hunt before you buy. Yeah, we're not buying. We're building. We're going to build our house right now. You really need to do this. Oh, huh? yeah, I do have to pick up Annie's slack. Oh, my God, look at all the stuff that she left me. With all of her life drama, she let everything pile up. Well, she is pregnant. I don't give a damn. I worked through the beginning of both of my pregnancies. What the hell? Look at that. Queenie lost her head. No, no. This was no accident. Annie decapitated her. I'm rooting for you guys. I really am. Hey? What are you doing? Annie hates Greenlee, so she purposely guillotined her. You don't know what Annie did or didn't do. Just let this go. You're defending Annie. Brian defends her. Even Greenlee defended her. So you're not going to let her go? No, I'm not, because she is an out-of-control head case. This has nothing to do with Ryan and loving Greenlee, no, any of that no, stuff? No, 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 it's not. I'm, I'm, I'm taking your advice, and I'm, I'm not trying to control other people's love lives. Good. Good. So this is about Annie needing serious medication or deep therapy or both. I think she could be dangerous. She could be more like her brother than oh, she lets on. Do that. No, Zach, I can see what you can't. Yeah? You see things that I can't. Yes, right? I can. Listen to me a second. I used to be very angry back when I hated my life and resented everyone who had it better than I did. I wanted to make the whole world pay, including my mom. And I did. So I can detect that kind of rage in other women. And I see it in Annie. Talk about it later. OK, I'm right about Annie. See you at home. Don't work too hard. Bye. Hey. We're building a house? Yep. Uh, How many of these have you had? Um, I don't know. I lost count. All right. Download's done. We're good to go. This program has everything we need to put our house together. Site work planner, floor plan, drawing tools, interior, exterior design capabilities. Amazing. You are amazing. So we put this house together, and then we give it to our own personal architect. Do we build him, too? No, I hired us a real one. Addison Neville. He's going to finalize the design of the property. But we don't have a property. You didn't. Ten acres, baby. Out by the yacht club. And it's all ours. <laughs> I actually borrowed this from Mr. Andoni downstairs to tighten the pipe under the sink in Emma's bathroom. It's leaking again? I think so. And I don't want to be on that plumber's waiting list again, so I just thought I'd take care of it myself. Where's Emma? She's actually at another sleepover. Another sleepover? Don't you think she's been doing too many of those? Well, this one wasn't exactly planned. She just got really excited because I told her about the baby. You told her about the baby? I know. We should have told her together, but it just kind of slipped. And she got so excited and said she wanted to tell Spike. So I took her over there. Rachel invited her to spend the night. I kind of couldn't convince her otherwise. I'm sorry. I know I should have waited. It's OK. I'll pick her up in the morning, and I'll take care of the pipe. Oh, no, no, it's OK. It's OK. I can do it. No, you need to rest, OK? I'll do it after, after my meeting. Meeting? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Meeting. It's not going to take very long. Are you going to see Greenlee? No, I'm not. Why would you think that? I saw you two together at Confusion yesterday. You were at Confusion yesterday? Why didn't you come over and join us? Because I was jealous. 
I know it sounds so stupid. I know you love me and Emma and this baby. I just, I don't know. I've just been feeling a little crazy lately. Hormones and work and everything. And I, oh, sorry. I told myself I wouldn't cry. You know what? It's fine. Go, go um, to your meeting. I'm being silly. Go. I'll be fine. Are you sure? Yes, I am so sure. Go. Go. Okay. <laughs> you're up to, sis. Miss me? <sighs> you know, you always try to convince yourself that you weren't crazy like me. But conjuring up dead brothers qualifies for pretty insane. Go away. I didn't think you had murder in you. But I guess I'm dead proof that you do. Shut up. And you've picked another target. Still using your weapon of choice, I see. But you've upgraded. Very cool. Hey. Bad time. If you're, uh, if you're looking for Annie, No, she's... I know. She's at home. I came to see you, actually. I tried oh. you at home first. What are you doing with this? Oh, well, it just it fell, so I was just trying to fix it. So, uh, what can I do for you? Why did you finally tell Greenlee? Tell her what? That I love her. Now she's going to go. So it's really, it's right up there on the hill, and there's going to be trees surrounding the house, which is going to shield it from the winter wind, and we can watch the most gorgeous sunsets. This could all be real. Yeah. I look through the gallery of homes, all the model homes, and I'll pick one out for us. I hope you like it, and we can change anything about it that you want. All right, you ready? Yeah. Look at this. I told her that you never. I, but listen, I didn't mean to, okay? She was being a huge pain in my butt, and she kept insisting that, that, that I was jealous of Annie, which is ridiculous. And I couldn't shut her up. She wouldn't stop talking, so it just came out. But I, I promise, I, uh, I, I, I promise we I did the best I could, and I covered for it. We ran into each other. The way she talked to me, the way she was looking at me, I knew. I knew that she knew something. And you wish that she said she loved you back. Kendall, stop it. I'm not doing anything. Uh, Greenlee is with Aiden, and I am with Annie. Yes, and she's having your baby. I know that, Ryan. I know who is with who and why. But I also know that you got the bum end of the deal. You're not happy. And you'll never be happy as long as you're with Annie. 